GPR is live. Uh, we got good news from Google this morning. They contacted us and said we did pass the pricing audit. And then we yeah tried to figure out if that meant we were live. And finally, we were able to start finding hospitable properties. And so we've got, you see there, we have 1,684 properties um, that you guys, uh, all direct customers, uh, basic and premium, can be involved with Google. You go to channels, you've scoped properties. This is how many we have right now. Uh, if you see there are 133 that are still getting processed. So when you scope your direct properties to Google, uh, it does take them up to two weeks to process images, to process your content, to do the validations that they do. Um, and then you'll start to see it in Google and Google travel and Google search, et cetera. Um, so right now we have 1,551 sites um, that are live on Google. We're going to start sharing uh, with you. We're still trying to figure out how we can pull all those URLs in from Google so you can immediately see your property. Um, but if you are scoped for GVR and you're live, you can also just search and find yourself on the map. So Miles, we can just look at those, what that looks like. So if you go to Google Travel, that's the easiest way to do it. You can also get it from the Google search bar. If you do the right terms, they'll start showing your short-term rental content. And there you see there's a hospitable listing at the top of the listings there. Um, zoom out on the map and they're listing now your direct content. So if you click on your listing there, you'll go to a landing page from Google and then that will drive them to your direct booking website to uh, complete the payment and convert to a booking that is still at this moment only available to hospitable URLs and hospitable sites. I think we do have a path to get there for custom URLs at least possibly also custom sites. Um, but because of the way Google does it, uh, we have to be a little bit careful how we do that because they give us a score as a channel partner. And we do have to provide a reliable uptime on all those things. We've talked about that before. So at the moment, you are required to have a hospitable URL, a hospitable site. If you don't have one, they're really easy to make. Um, but we do anticipate being able to support um, custom sites and custom URLs soon. But great news for a lot of our direct hosts. Um, we're going to be monitoring that and report back on how effective that's, that is as a channel and, and future town halls. Um, but super excited. And thank you all for your patience. This has been a long slog. Uh, it was a lot of complexity involved, a lot of lost time and different, uh, I don't know, rabbit holes that <laughs> we went down with Google together. Um, but it's live now, and we hope to have really, really good news and a high-performing channel for you guys on direct. So thanks for all your feedback. Thanks for all your patience on the way. Big news there. And